In this CapCut tutorial, I'll show you how to circle crop a talking head video and add a border to the video in CapCut. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. Now, I'll show you three ways to do this. They're pretty simple. Please follow along. Now, the reason why I'm doing the three of them is you may need to use uh, whatever uh, way that you feel works best for you. Now, I'll just drag uh, my fast footage here with my talking head. And then I'll just split it uh, right about there and remove this part here. So we have it right there. Now we are inside the basic tab. Next, we're going to go to the mask tab here and then click on circle crop. And this is kind of the circle mask and then adjust it to where we want it to be. Just move it uh, to where you feel uh, that it works best for you. So it's right there. Looks good. If you try to kind of move this right now, it's going to move the mask and not the talking head. So for you to move the talking head, you need to be inside the basic tab here, but you can easily move this to where you want it to be. And if all you wanted to do was just a circle crop without a background, then there you have it. It's pretty slick, looks good. And I feel that it's more or less all that you want to do if you wanted to create a circle crop for your talking head videos. Now, let's take it a little bit further. Let's assume you want to kind of add a background to uh, this particular circle crop, uh, maybe a background somewhere here. So what we're going to do when we're in the basic tab here, we're going to scroll down to the bottom and you'll see canvas here. Just click on this particular none, click on color, and then you can choose uh, the color that you want to have as your background that is for the border. So let's say we go with this light pink, it looks good. And once you do that, you'll need to create a compound clip. Now, that looks good. Everything is okay. But now we need to remove this particular background. So I'm going to go back to the mask tab, click on the circle again. And now we're going to readjust this circle to kind of fill in our talking head. And then we can make uh, some adjustments the way we feel uh, that they need to be. We can maybe bring in this slightly, uh, maybe somewhere here. Just make sure that uh, you don't cut off anything as you're trying to make your adjustments so that everything looks good. Now, it takes uh, a couple of tries to get it perfectly uh, in order where you want it to be. Uh, we can just move this slightly and more or less looks okay. Uh, it's not kind of uniform, but you get the, the gist of this. So uh, once you're done, go back to basic and you have your circle crop uh, with a border. And now you can adjust this to scale it to where you want it to be. And now you can move it up and then bring in your video. Let's say a tutorial video. And you can see uh, you have your video uh, as a circle crop down here. And then your tutorial video in the background. That is method number one. Let's delete this. Let's go to method number two. For method number two, I'll just make it simple. Just add a background image here. And then once I add a background image, I'll just bring in my video. Again, just cut out this particular part uh, where there's nothing going on, uh, nothing major going on uh, up to about some about here. Just split it and delete this. Uh, and then I can actually just remove this, delete. And then once I do that is uh, what we can do now is we can create our first mask. Just quickly adjust it to where we want it to be. Move it slightly. That's okay. And that's done. Next up, we can mask our background. And you can see that it's super, super easy, super fast to adjust. Maybe the only downside is that you cannot change uh, like the color. Uh, but there we go. Looks good. And then just create a compound clip of this and then just size it and put it wherever you want it to be. You can bring it up slightly and then add a video, a tutorial video and just continue talking like you would in any other uh, more or less tutorial video with a circle crop talking head video. So. That's method number two. Let's go to method number three. And method number three more or less involves uh, using uh, the text. And here is our video. I can just take out the useless part, split, delete here. 
Let's go back to the start. Now, for this one, we just go to the mask, circle mask. Just create your circle mask again. Uh, looks good. And uh, one of the things I wish was available inside the mask is creating like a border and probably it adheres to this particular uh, border that we've created for the mask. That would be awesome. But now we'll get out of th uh, the mask option here and go to basic. Once we're in basic, we're going to get some text. And let's say just go with the default. Uh, make it the length of our clip. Uh, we want it to be, let's say up to there. And then remove the default text. There are two options that we can do here. We can either put a full stop and then scale it up. Or you can also do a capital O and then scale it up to whatever you want it to be. So uh, kind of... I find the capital O is kind of cumbersome, but we can still increase it to where you want it to be. Uh, still looks good. I'm finding it to be a little bit too thick for this, so you may need to use a thin font uh, for this. But that's the O, and uh, the good thing is that you can change the color to whatever you want, but you need to use a thin font. No. The alternative would be to use a full stop, and uh, with a full stop, all you need to do is just now just the size remember it gets out of focus really quickly so you need to know what you're doing so you don't do it too much you can also kind of size it for yourself next up we can bring up uh, this particular like bring the text down here and then once we bring it there we can make adjustments depending on what we want or we can actually just adjust our video somewhere up here so that our full stop and just come up slightly to avoid it being cut off in the video. Uh, now if we go back to our footage here and add our sequence and then create a compound clip of these two. Uh, we can now adjust the size to whatever we want it to be. And then come here. You can see that our footage Imagine. is right there with our circle crop now those are three easy ways to circle crop a talking head video and add a border in CapCut for windows pc or mac i hope this tutorial is of value and it's in-depth enough for you to understand the different things uh, maybe the one option that i would say if i delete this too especially for the last tutorial uh, or more or less all tutorials if you want to make sure that you can arrange any layer uh, whatever it wants that's the text layer to be below uh, the video layer or whatever media ensure that these arranged uh, layers is turned on and you click without anything on the canvas here you can just click on modify and turn it on so remember cannot be turned off after turned on uh that's okay the reason why i'm saying that is because somebody might come into the comments and say i'm not able to move the text up and down or maybe change the positionings and so on and so forth but that is how you can circle crop a talking head video and add a border in CapCut for windows pc and mac in three simple ways Thanks for watching. Until next time, stay safe and never stop learning.